Hello and welcome. In this video, we'll take a look at two issues which can happen with the Chromecast Remote Control. The first issue is if the Chromecast Remote Control has been accidentally deleted in settings. What this effectively means is the remote control can no longer control the Chromecast. The second issue we'll take a look at is if you've moved your Chromecast to a different television, you may find that the remote control no longer controls the TV. You cannot use the volume up, volume down, the power, or the source. So let's get these sorted out. The easiest way to reconnect your Chromecast remote control if it's been accidentally deleted is to use your phone or tablet. Just make sure Bluetooth is turned on, then head towards your App Store or Play Store and do a search for Android TV. This is the app here and it's made by Google. Download that and you'll have an icon which looks just like this, Android TV. Press it and when it first starts, it's going to ask you to click OK ask you to agree to the terms and conditions. Then it will ask you to do a quick search for your Chromecast. Once that's found, it looks just like this. It's a very basic controller, but it's all we need to reconnect the original controller. So now we have control, we can use the arrow key to get across to the right-hand corner, go to settings, and we're going to add back the original remote control. So we click OK here using the center button. Now down the left hand side, use the arrow keys again, and we're heading down towards remotes and accessories. Once there, click OK. Click OK again. And now it's searching for the accessory. So grab your original remote control and press and hold the home button and the back button at the same time. You'll see the light at the bottom of the remote control there and it has located the remote control. Go back to your phone and just press OK in the center and you'll see that it says pairing. After a short while, it says paired. Now you can go back to your original remote control, press any of the buttons and normal service is resumed. If you've moved your Chromecast to a different television and you want to be able to control the volume on it as well as the power and source, here's what you do. Move along the top menu to the right hand side, then go down to settings. Select that. On the list on the left, go down until you get to remotes and accessories. Click OK. Go to the bottom of this list, set up remote buttons. Select that. Add device, add a TV, receiver or soundbar. Select that select TV and it asks what brand of TV you have. Now it has all the popular ones here and you can go across to the left hand side and it also has them alphabetically. So I'll select LG for myself. Now it says set up the remote to control your device. Volume, click OK. Then next and you can hear the volume and you can use the up and down buttons to control it as you would normally. Do the volume buttons work? We can say yes. Power. Set up the remote to control your device. Click OK. And it says press the power button. The TV should turn off. Wait eight seconds and press it again. I'll just press this and we'll see if it works on the other side. That powered on after eight seconds. No problems there. So we can say that the power button worked. Just ignore that menu that's just popped up at the bottom. That's from LG because I've turned the TV on. Right. Input. Next up, click OK again. Press the source button. Did the input button work? On this occasion, no. It's trying another code, so let's press it again. Did the button work this time? Yes, and I'm pressing it, and it's cycling through the different sources. Great. So the TV is now officially set up. I can use the volume, the power, and the source. So hopefully you found this useful. If you have, really appreciate it. You can give the video a quick thumbs up. It lets me know that it's helping you guys. Thank you very much for choosing my video. And if you like videos like this, be sure to check out the playlists on my channel. Have a great day. Cheers.